Interesting Facts About the Bible, Part 59. Did you know that there is evidence that the New Testament was originally written in Hebrew and not Greek? Above Yeshua's head on the cross, the sign that said, King of the Jews, was written in Hebrew, Latin, and Greek. This lets us know that the Jews were speaking and reading Hebrew at that time. We know through other Jewish writings from this time period that the average educated Jew spoke and wrote Mishneg Hebrew. Jews fought to keep their culture wherever they were exiled to. That's why dreidel is played at Hanukkah. When the Greeks outlawed studying the Torah during the Maccabean Revolt, the Jews would pretend to have dreidel games while they studied. They would not set aside their language and writings easily. We also see in the Talmud that Jewish scholars wanted to destroy the New Testament scrolls, but that it had the sacred name yod heh vav -He, written in them. This shows that they were written in Hebrew. We also know that Matthew was definitely written in Hebrew because several bishops of the early Catholic Church stated that it was and that the church had translated it. We can also see that there are obvious transliterations of some words from Hebrew to Greek. For example, Yeshua is written as Jesus in the Greek. They didn't have the ye sound and used ye. They didn't use the sh sound and used s. And almost all male names ended in os or us, thus the name Jesus. So why are we taught that the New Testament was written in Greek? Many historians claim it is because an original Hebrew manuscript was never found, even though there is clear historical evidence that there was a Hebrew manuscript. But who took over the Jewish faith of the early Messianic believers? Who would stand to benefit from the books being in Greek and not Hebrew? Who established a church outside of the original Jewish believers and tried to claim the new teachings of Yeshua as their own? the Roman Catholic Church. The Roman Catholic Church is also known to have kept many important biblical documents and artifacts hidden from the public eye in the Vatican vaults. My guess, if we could find an original Hebrew New Testament, that's where it would be.